Hey guys, how's it going? Coach Tyson from Arc Strength. Uh, today I'm gonna be sharing my workout with you guys. I'll cut our documentary the Bonon Sakena, but we'll do more uh, videos such as this from different coaches and different athletes uh, from Arc Strength. So I like I say, made a workout. Oh, it's a off-season workout. I'm you know infinite weeks away from my competition, but we still gotta put in the work. So for now, let's go and get warmed up. So as you might have guessed, squat, bicycle, uh, warm up bicycle, just basic stretches, and just some activation for the glutes and just opening up the uh, what do you say the uh, lower back, upper back, quads, glutes, and uh, just just clear going you know? and then uh, I spend most of the time in the barbell warm up. So let's get to the barbell. So get out when you normally gym my train or the but I like there I don't think they're gonna be too much in the vlog but besides our company on the training and I'm letting them use the power rack because you know I log box same so and mere like all gonna put some plus my training man this the guy so I know I'm just gonna be using the power rack and luckily we have two power bars not only so many war in China normally they any rab understanding it's okay Aru like whoever has the hardest workout basically uses the best equipment. So Mirad's the lightest session by the way. I'm sacrificing it for them. Barbell warm up, Goryo. Bigger jumps, I usually take big jumps. 120, 180, eh, 150 and 180. Normally 170, but uh, as of the first working set, this is gonna be a set of four at RPE 6, and I've got a tempo 5 3 1, so which basically means five seconds on the eccentric, uh, two second pause, and uh, zero second up. So let's see how this goes. Ani, I've got ascending set 6 7, only last match, uh, top set at an RPE 8, so uh, let's work up to it. Alright, so first set done, 180 for 4 reps. I was like, oh, I wasn't expecting uh, the set to be so difficult. I was like, 180, 190, 200 for 2 into 4, got so so I say, but uh, it felt a bit difficult, so I'm not gonna go the full 5 kg jump, so maybe. Banu, 185 got 187. 187.5 for my second set. They're the garros, I know that. Cost of like the tempo, they got like a lot. I think I'll ask the way, okay? And you guys obviously know tempo sucks, man. So here we go, 187. I ran up a check, I might do it again. Enemies close, have me thinking they're friends. Ten toes down, I'll be free until the end. Crib outside the city, I don't feel safe in my ass. Took so many years, I've been swaying for the wins. I'm in debt to no one but the one who took my sins. I do it for real, there's no reason to pretend. If I do it once, I do it again. Add it up, add it up. So, uh, last set, setting up the camera because I have to send this video to the coach. Atoko top set is inspired by Ojas. Yes. 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 Competition <laughs> <laughs> on Based on RPO. Oh, based on RPO, and plus, I'm the rest. 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 I'm 
Oh, but let's see how the last set goes and we'll talk after. Go! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Landing! I'm just doing me, everything is on me. Oh, you matter what? Add it up, add it up. Bankroll, bankroll. Euro, euro. Peso, peso. Add it up. I'm just doing me, everything is on me. Oh, you matter what? Add it up. Told her if it's all me, everything is on me. Go and back it up. Matter what? Told you I'ma do me. Why you hating on me? It's not adding up. All right, guys. Uh, just got done with tempo squats. Start karda se was feeling a bit off, like asto tight na mila jisto. I think it's also got to do with uh, the two days off we took before this workout. But as I started going, it started feeling much, much, much better, and I ended up with uh, 200 for my final set, uh, five, three, zero tempo. Uh, the fourth set was with 200 kgs, and it felt like an. I think an RP of eight, considering tempo, my lungs is gonna fail before and the actual kutta and everything because athine thaksan da. But now we're gonna move on to the bench press. Today I've got a touch and go bench and bench se abe orang matre samsung ka competition spec ko saadi sharing it with the boys and hamro bench sabe jana ka lagbar within 10 kgs range ma sabe jana ka pawar round sa and it height bari sabe ko milsa. So we're gonna bench in together. Uh, to talk about uh, tempo squats, I usually use Garsa Banda. It's usually, uh, I don't know exactly why, when uh, my coach is planning on picking me because I don't have a fixed date. But so so that can it say. Normally, tempo squat is before a hypertrophy phase or during a hypertrophy phase, meaning further away from the competition. So I'm probably not going to be picking anytime soon. So we're trying to fix some imbalances, uh, finding the midfoot perfectly, create a good time equal pressure, breathing, bracing, and just. Uh, getting more intentional with moving the weight how it's supposed to. So yeah, uh, so far so good. And now let's go do some bench press. It's a touch and go bench, and my top set is 120 for a triple, and then I will got a few back down sets. मेरे आज को टप सेट इज वन हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेंटी फर ट्रिपल विच इज टच एंड गो एंड सैडली तो नभन बट कसरी भनफर्चुनेटली एनीवे मेरे टच एंड गो बेंच इज एक्चुअली विकर दैन मेरे नर्मल पर्स बेंच बिकज आई क्रिएट सो मच टेन्सन एट द बटम अभी तो रिलीज कर सकते सो आई थिंक इट्स मोर फर हाइपर चुकी वर्क एंड लाइक आई सेंग अगे ना डेडलिफ्ट कर स्क्वाड कर It's more non-specific training, just working the parts that I'm weak at, and really trying to use the back and all those things. So uh, let's do the first top set, and then we'll move on to the back off set, which is four sets of three with 110 kg. Again, that's it. Right. Ride with me if you ride with me. You can slide with me if you feel like 550 on the five stick. You can get high with me. That's a deal, right? That's a deal, right? That's a bet, right? That's a bet, right? That's a deal, right? That's a deal, right? That's a bet, right? That's a deal, right? That's a deal, right? All right, guys. So just got done with the top set. Like I was saying, only got the rust in it. Unsa touch and go, especially because my like chest my control got that just feels a bit odd. And you, mirror alka, a new technique taught from like six or seven uh, months back, which is to try to tear the elbows more, use the back more, and close angle or a little different. So, but I think it's a good addition to use the touch and go because I get more efficient in getting into the proper position because mirror pump bench is pretty much like a. Tempo pause bench, but uh, we're getting hang of it. How about just some back of that left, and uh, we'll move on to acceleration. All right, guys. So just got done with the bench. As a bench, say it felt like a bit of a stretch because I'm looking at they're prepping only 
longer rest, more warm up. It's not bad. My legs felt like a stretch just because my hip wasn't there. 120 the triples here, and some back offset, which obviously is very very easy at this point. But then, I like to train in the main purpose. Obviously, is to get stronger in the long run. But at the moment, is to build more efficiency, more technical prowess, more uh, intention in training, and uh, just getting the mind right, getting the technique dialed in, and try to push. Volume slowly over time, so I can handle more loads, that which will eventually make me stronger in the future, right? Now, and this is something that most of the lifters miss because they are always constantly chasing PRs, any day by day or even session. With Trevani, they are trying to uh, push themselves till they pretty much fail or max out and feel like that's gonna take them further. But then sometimes we really have to take a take a step back and so that we can set ourselves uh, with a solid foundation and then push. Uh, forward in training. Anyways, that was pretty much everything. Now I've got some dumbbell RDLs and some side plank uh, to finish the workout, which will uh, be to finish the workout and uh, pretty much done for the day. Anyways, guys, uh, thank you guys so much for watching this training log. Let me know how you liked it. If you learned something, or do you want us to talk about specific topics or some other athletes that you want to see? especially because they're peaking and and if you want coaching uh we please check out our website which is going to be live this monday so you'll be the saturday on some monday but uh, the website is going to be live so if you're looking for training templates at an affordable price it's there supplementation uh, uh gym apparel especially the belt i live through my eye right so yeah pretty much so that's it and we will see you in the next video